That Exol camp has a high concentration of registered criminals, Pathfinder. Vetro was looking for you. You have AVP outstanding, Pathfinder. Hey, Jaw. <laughs> Didn't mean to scare you. What? Uh, I'm... I'm not scared. Uh, one second. What's going on in here? You look busy. If I'm busy, my mind is occupied with whatever I'm working on, uh, rather than worrying. Whatever gets you through. Uh, I'd like your advice on something. I'm making gifts. For everyone. I have a list. Gifts? Hmm. Do Turians like poetry? For Vetra, I'm writing a poem and engraving it on... Uh, well, I, I'm not sure yet. Who doesn't like a personalized poem? Great. <laughs> Maybe I could just recite it for her. Make sure I'm there for that. Uh, Liam seems to like my Rothgin. I might sew him one. He does. Do Krogan like knives? I could craft a ceremonial Angaran dagger for Drac. Who wouldn't want that? It's mainly decorative. Would... You like one? Jal, this is a lot of work. What's really going on? I'm sure that I seem confident and skilled to you, but I'm not. Or I don't feel like I am. Well... I think you're great. <laughs> That's... so... It's true. <clears throat> you're making me blush. I can't tell. My family is well known. 
Our lineage is respected, and many of my kin have achieved great things. I've never been one of them. So many older siblings and cousins who succeeded at everything. I stopped trying to keep up. Right. Thanks for listening. You're not in anyone's shadow here. I believe in you. Pathfinder, this is Captain Dunn. There's a situation I could use your assistance with. I'd rather not discuss it over open channels. Please come see me on the Hyperion Bridge as soon as you can. Tell our leaders! Wake the sleepers! Plan before, Crow. Tell our leaders! Wake the sleepers! Plan before cronies. Our nexus, our lives. Hey, what's going on? That's your new galaxy. Making speeches about some fresh start while your kids stay frozen. And it's all thanks to your Pathfinder. Excuse me? We've waited months for our families to come out of stasis. They should have gone to your outpost. But since you think research is so important, military personnel got bumped down the list. Like my clan, brothers. All the reassignments mean they're in ten different colony blocks now. And my mother just got caught in the middle. I founded the outpost. I didn't decide who would stay in stasis. You don't care that you've torn families apart? That's not what I said. Maybe you could still make this right. I just want Mom out of stasis. That's all anyone here wants. You do stasis revivals. You can tell our leaders you're opening those pods. Today. I authorize whole colony blocks or a few emergency revivals. I can't wake dozens of random people. We don't care whose finger pushes the button. If you can't, our leaders can. And if you tell them, they will. This is a big issue. Bigger than just my say-so. Bullshit. You're the hero right now. They'll do anything you say. We tried petitioning Addison. She ignored us. 
Screw her! Start with Kandros. He sent those ten soldiers over there. Maybe he'll take us seriously. Our Nexus! Our lives! Our Nexus! Our lives! Any word? So how things go? The materials you found were perfect. You got more. We're getting the Solarian Ark settled in now. People keep asking about the Natanis, but it's a big cluster. We'll find them. Just so you know. 